Ladies and gentlemen, this is Larry from the Shizzle Network here back again, and I'm here to give a very important update on uh, Reptile v. Crowdra. Now, previously, I did make an update video as far as the future of Shizzle Network is concerned, like why I haven't been uploading videos recently and all that stuff. Now, I want to explain what's going to happen with Reptile v. Crowdra. You guys might be wondering whether or not if Reptile v. Crowdra is going to happen or not. Now, here's the answer to your question. Reptile v. Crodra is still going to happen. Um, Reptile v. Crodra, um has been on a brief hiatus recently, only because of my busy life, but um, starting very recently, I have been working more, I'm going to be working more with Reptile v. Crodra. In fact, probably a little bit after I record this video, I'm probably going to have a chat with, uh, Levon as far as, you know, working on the film again and whatnot. Just know that, uh, Reptile v. Crodra is still going to happen. Um, it's going to be released in July of 2018. I figured that would be the perfect time to actually, you know, release the film to coincide with my 19th birthday and if Shizzle Network still doesn't do well by that time the possible retirement from Shizzle Network so it's going so July of 2018 is going to be one of the most emotional months of this year because if like I said if Shizzle Network doesn't still do as good as it once did then I'm most likely going to retire from Shizzle Network um, and it's going to be one of the saddest days in history especially for Shizzle Network fans out there. But like I said, it's only possible. It's not a definite. It only depends on what happens. So pretty much you guys, the fans, are responsible for that choice. It's almost like you guys are making that choice. You guys choose whether or not Shizzle Network is going to die or live. You know, it's up to you. But anyways, back to my point. Um... About Shizzle, about Reptile v. Crowdra, the movie is still going to happen. Like I said, it's going through major rewrites. The entire movie is going to be reshot. So I want you guys to keep that in mind. The whole movie is going to be, you know, is going to get reshot. So I want you guys to keep that in mind. Um, but pretty much there's nothing else that I got to say. I just wanted to give you guys an update on the Reptile v. Crocha movie. I want you guys to know that it's still going to happen. The movie is going through rewrites right now and even the reshoots. In fact, Reptile v. Crocha is going to look a lot more professional now, especially with this DSLR that I'm using right now because you guys can clearly see, like, I can actually, like, you know, the camera is in very high quality. It's in 24 mega, 24.2 megapixels as opposed to the uh, 14 megapixel digital camera that I was using to film uh, Reptile v. Crowdra. This time, I'm actually using a more powerful camera. And this time, I can actually gain more, you know, more footage and, you know, much more high quality footage that you guys would see from the movies and whatnot. Because, like I said, it's in 24.2 megapixels. And I can also change the FPS on the camera as I record the footage, you know, when I'm filming. So I wanted to give you guys that update. The movie is still going to happen. It's just that right now, I'm trying to take care of things. But um, I'm most likely I'm going to get back to work on Red Tavi Crowdra. I'm most likely starting today because, you know, since I'm not really doing much, like, you know, I'm still looking for jobs right now and I'm still working with college. At the same time, I can still devote my time towards um, making, you know, Red Tavi Crowdra. So that's really all I have to say.